Animal Jam did die. Animal Jam did die. I don't believe it. They don't even upload videos anymore. Down, 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 down. You're gonna see tons of new cool stuff that you never thought would be possible on Animal Jam. No, no, I don't believe it. This game right here is based on Flash. And Flash is the thing that stops working at the end of 2019. This is the worst thing ever. Could you imagine Animal Jam with graphics like this? Oh, ho, ho, yes. Is Animal Jam really dying? Um, I'm not happy about it. Yeah, it's the Shop King. Yeah, it's Shop King time. Yo, what's going on, everybody? Shop King in the house. <laughs> Today, we're going to be talking about the death of Animal Jam. The death of Animal Jam. Animal Jam is dying. Do you believe it? I don't believe it. I don't know, man. A party just quit. No, no, I don't believe it. It seems like Rip Animal Jam is all we're hearing nowadays. Rip Animal Jam. This is something that people have been talking about more and more for the past couple of months. It seems like Animal Jam is slowly dialing, di dialing? dialing phone numbers for help. So we're going to talk about a couple of different reasons why Animal Jam is um, going downhill. But we're also going to talk about the future of Animal Jam, which might be very exciting. So 2017 was one of the best years for Animal Jam. They hooked up with Jazzwares. They came out with all of these different toys, Adopt-a-Pets, different play sets and plushies and all sorts of stuff like that. And all of these toys were in all of these stores and all of the kids going into these stores would learn about Animal Jam and they would go sign up for Animal Jam. So Animal Jam got a ton of new users in 2017. It kept on growing and growing and growing. But then at the very end of 2017, the partnership with Jazzwares, the toy company, ended. We don't know why it ended, but we know it did end it. It did end it. So that's over with. No more Animal Jam toys in the stores. And what does that mean? That means no more kids finding out about Animal Jam. And what does that mean? Well, if we look at Animal Jam's traffic ranks for this year, you can see how Here's January, and it goes down, 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 down. They have lost so much traffic, and one of the big reasons is because those toys are no longer in the stores. The, the toys were free promotion, and they went from being ranked 6,000 to 12,000. So not having those toys in the stores has really affected Animal Jam, but it's not the only thing. If we go take a look at Animal Jam's official YouTube page, they have their banner here with all of the Jambassadors on it. Pretty cool looking banner, but guess what? Almost all of these people are no longer active. They don't even upload videos anymore. And if we look at their possum channels over here, Really, there's only three people on here who are actively uploading Animal Jam videos. That's Jelly Jones, Bepper, and Wisteria Moon. So this whole banner, there's basically just three people on it that are promoting Animal Jam. So when your most popular players decide to quit, the people who watch those videos are losing interest in Animal Jam and they stop playing Animal Jam also. So reason number one, toys, gone. Reason number two, Jambassadors, quitting. Reason number three, play wild. A lot of Animal Jam users have been commenting about this over the past couple of months. It sort of feels like Wildworks is more focused on play wild than they are on Animal Jam. The updates on Animal Jam, they really have not been that great the past couple of months. They have actually been disappointing and a lot of users have been getting upset over that and a lot of people have just been quitting over that. They have even added Play Wild to Steam. So in my opinion, those are the top three reasons why Animal Jam 
is dying. The toys are gone, the Jambassadors are quitting, and the updates have been disappointing. Those are the top three reasons. I mean, we haven't seen new dens and new animals. They did bring in an owl, but we already have an owl. And one thing that a lot of people don't realize is animaljam.com right here on your computer. It will stop working at the end of 2019. This will not work. You won't be able to get on your computer January 1st, 2020 and go to animaljam.com and play Animal Jam. You can still download the app. Don't freak out. You'll still be able to download the app and play it. And they might even add it to Steam, just like they have added Play Wild. And who knows, they might even add it to Epic Games. If you haven't heard of Epic Games, I'm sure you've heard of Fortnite. Oh man, could you imagine Animal Jam with graphics like this? Like with the animals looking so realistic? That would be lit. That would be so cool. And it is something that is possible because Epic Games released their gaming engine that developers use to develop games so anyone can create games like this. I mean, you have to be a good programmer, but imagine if there was an Animal Jam with graphics like this, because this game right here is based on Flash, and Flash is the thing that stops working at the end of 2019. So there will be no more Flash games, and there's only really so much you can do with Flash. Look at this, ooh la la. That's why Play Wild has so many more features than just regular Animal Jam, because Animal Jam is in Flash, and Flash is gone. So after 2019, when this is gone, I think Animal Jam is going to have so many opportunities to do so many cool stuff. So many cool stuff? Stuffs? Things? <laughs> they might even be able to do stuff like this. Who knows? Animal Jam might get a total redesign. There will probably be tons of new features that they just couldn't do before with Flash because Flash is really old. It's been around forever. But being able to do stuff like this, that would really be exciting. Now, I for one don't think Animal Jam is dying. I think, yeah, a lot of the Jam Bastards have been quitting, but you have to be, uh, you have to be remembering that they have been playing this game since 2010. Like almost 10 years, they've been playing the same game. So they might be getting bored of it. They might have other things they want to do in their life. So uh, they don't have time for Animal Jam anymore. But you know what? If we check the latest stats, it's starting to get more popular. It's starting to make its way back up. So this means things may be turning around for Animal Jam. So I think the next year is going to be very interesting, 2019, because it's going to be the last year that Animal Jam is going to be in Flash. And in 2020, that's when really exciting things can happen. They may even find a way to merge Animal Jam and Play Wild. Could you imagine that? I don't know how they would do that, but I'm sure it's something that they have thought of. I don't know, but what I do know is if you go play Animal Jam in 2020, you're gonna see tons of new cool stuff that you've never seen before and that you never thought would be possible on Animal Jam. And I also think that they're gonna get with a new toy company and start putting out new toys and new promos and stuff like that. And that's gonna get a lot of people excited about Animal Jam and that'll get them a lot more players. So hopefully that happens soon. But one thing they can do right now is get some brand new Jambassadors. I think that's very important because you want people who promote your game. You want active players who still love Animal Jam who still make videos about Animal Jam, who are excited about Animal Jam. So I think they need to totally revamp their Jambassador ship. 
thing. So those are pretty much my thoughts on the death of Animal Jam. Is Animal Jam really dying? Um, no. It did, it did die. Animal Jam did die. But it's starting to come back to life. And the future is exciting. And we'll see how they handle it. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Okay, well go ahead, leave your thoughts down below. Don't forget to click that thumbs up button. Subscribe to Shop King. We got a lot of cool um, giveaways coming soon. And I got some very cool videos on the way. So we'll see you on the next one. Peace.